Hey guys, I just wanted to show you proper equipment holding with a small dog. So I like using these very small, narrow, lightweight nylon leashes with a smaller dog. So this one is a 5'8 width and it's 4 feet long. So 5'8 is the widest leash I would use on a small dog. You can go even smaller if you want, half inch or 3 eighths. Um, but I like it nice and thin and lightweight. That helps us feel the dog really well through the leash. And it also ensures that there's not too much weight hanging on the, the small dog's neck, right? Um, the other thing that you notice is how I hold the leash. So with these tiny dogs, the part of the leash that actually extends down to the prong collar, I hold between my thumb and my first finger. So we're not gonna like hold it in a tight hand grip. We're not gonna wrap this leash around our wrist or anything like that. I actually want this leash to slip through my fingers should anything happen. So if I, for instance, trip and stumble, I want the leash to slip through my fingers so that Frankie doesn't get pulled on. When you're holding a leash on a small dog in like a really tight grip, or wrapping it around yourself, it is way too easy to unintentionally harm them if something happens. If you give your arm a, jeet, a jerk, or you trip and fall or stumble or something like that, these little guys are so tiny that you can give them a really uncomfortable jolt. So we wanna make sure that we're holding our equipment properly at all times for maximum communication, but also so that we're keeping the small dog safe and comfortable.